In Larimer Square, beneath the banners, the restaurants and shops, below the surface, lives rarely told Denver history. Denver is where the West came to play, much like today. Our tour guide is Kevin Rucker, a historian at MSU Denver. Yes, this is a very unique layout that we have down here. We're in the back halls of Green Russell Cocktail Lounge and Russell Smokehouse on Larimer Street, once a popular underground speakeasy when Colorado went dry. A lot of these were service tunnels bringing coal and other items like this, but also during Prohibition, this is where all the bootleg liquor was moving. Tunnels with exclusive entrances reserved for the city's prominent people to get a drink. You would have like the mayor and the police chief and city councilmen, they would be coming through here but also uh, miners, cattlemen. It was amazing. Jacqueline Bonanno is the owner. She and her husband, Chef Frank Bonanno, named it Green Russell after the first person to strike gold in Colorado. She had no idea what was beyond the walls. We had to expand the dining room um, by tearing down these little storage <sighs> units. And once the storage units were gone, you could see all these different pathways. If there weren't locked doors along the way, I would have been everywhere around here. Nowadays, you can still get a cocktail at the old bar. The stories, smells, and ambiance are what makes the place special. When we were doing the plumbing for the smokehouse side, there were horse skeletons, and that's from the Gold Rush era. You no longer have to go through the back entrance to get in. Just don't expect they only sell pies. Discretion was always very key to these places. John Glasgow, 9 News.